Sean. New York City is in crisis tonight, with reports of Valkyr-related gang war in the streets of the Bronx. Apparently, Max Payne, wanted for questioning in connection with the slaying of a DEA special agent earlier tonight, is waging a one-man war against his former partners in crime. Among the list of casualties so far are notorious Mafia members Joey and Virgilio Finito, as well as Rico Muerte, himself a fugitive from the law and a suspect for several murders in the Chicago area. The NYPD has been placed on full alert. A citywide APB has been put out on Max Payne. Deputy Chief Jim Brevera has promised to take whatever steps necessary to bring him to justice. What those steps may be remains to be seen. For NYCNN TV News, this is Kira Silver. Someone who looks the part down to the finest detail, except that he's evil. I'm hiding in the shadows, watching it all unfold. The flamingo speaks. He can speak here. It says, Mirrors are more fun than television. That's, mirrors are more fun than television. Somehow I know this, just don't ask me how. <laughs> and I, not me, but my double nods and smirks at this, like it was the funniest thing in the world. Always red or blue. Vinny got needy. Just the man I've been killing to see. Pain? Freaking fed! I knew from day one there was something screwy about you. What do you think you're doing? You're a freaking cop. You ain't got squad on us. You can't just come in here waving your peace like it meant something. Yeah! Oh my god! Oh god, you shot me! Ah! You're dead, Pain! What the hell are you waiting for, you apes? Kill him! Kill him! With pleasure, boss. Got me to bailed. I made like Chow Yun fat. A crumpled 
letter lay on Gagnini's desk. The letter was addressed to Don Punchinello, but Vinny had never had the nerve to finish it. Jack's gone voodoo. Just the other night, he shot Dino because he wanted to see what his brains looked like splattered on the wall. He's a freaking mad dog. We're running out of men and business fast. Gagnini had been living in mortal fear of his boss. Jack Lupino was a psycho. Gagnetti was running scared. He could run, but with a boy in the stomach like a broken bottle of Tabasco, he was quickly running out of time. He knew where his boss was, and I wanted to square things up with Jack Lupino. Gagnetti would be moving fast. I don't know about angels, but it's fear that gives men wings. Gagnetti hitched a ride. To catch him, I'd have to follow his lead. <laughs> 